back in Ottawa again. Sorry I didn't vlog much of the beginning of August. I was just so consumed with work, errands, all these things that had to get organized. So I really didn't do anything interesting at all. It was super boring. But because both Ty and I are still working remotely, we want to spend more time with our families. So we're back in Ottawa. And today I will be doing a bridal hair trial. Um, I'm narrowing down who I want as my hairstylist for my wedding. And I want to test a few out before I commit to anyone because I'm very picky. So I'm actually going to a high school friend of mine. Uh, she's a hairstylist and makeup artist. So she's going to style my hair today and I'm gonna see if I like it. So I'm at Alaha's. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> you get it. I'm really bad at talking on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Getting the herd did back here. Jen's come to visit. This is the first time seeing Jen since March. You're a different woman to me now. Can't really see yeah, back there, but I'm trusting that it's gonna. No, I won't be surprised. Okay. I won't be surprised. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Gathered at dinner to open Jen's uh, bridesmaid boxes. Stacy's been waiting. <laughs> We're finally being asked. Yeah. They've been doing tasks way before this was. I know, asked. right? Yes. Had to attend your wedding dress stuff. Like I was there. I'm like, am I even gonna be at your wedding? I don't know. <laughs> am I even I've heard, heard the wedding asking on the Facebook. <laughs> But did she even ask us? Oh, yeah, she did. She did. Like and then I heard it in the change room. Like, <laughs> okay, I'm gonna open it. You wanna open it? Okay, go ahead, guys. Don't read the card out loud, please. Why? We should all read out loud together. Ooh. Hey, there's ginger ale. Sweet. That's what I, was I was gonna say, I don't know if Sylvia knows. Wait, oh, did everyone get alcohol? Yeah. I got ginger ale. <laughs> I was like, you know True. I know you know True. True. <laughs> Yeah. Awesome. Staring at me like a maniac. Oh. So, yeah, cute hand sanitizer. Yo, I love this shit. <laughs> it's because you know, like you're gonna get headaches at my wedding. Yeah, movie, probably. And you're just gonna roll that stuff yeah, on. migraines for sure. Yeah. What's in here? What okay. is in here? No, I'm not gonna be. <laughs> I say yeah. <laughs> I say yeah. Oh, that's a nice photo of us. <laughs> His eyes were cute. Me and Lily pointing. Yo, we ate so many fries. Savage. Okay, so obviously I didn't want to show you guys my final hair because that's a surprise. But I'm happy to say that I was really happy with it. I was actually surprised that we kind of really got the whole look that I wanted in one shot so it blew me away and I was very happy with the entire look and it only makes me more excited for my wedding. Happy August guys! We're going to start this month's vlog off with a little bit of a unbox- well I guess it's not a box so it's not an unboxing, it's an unbagging. It says bride on it. This bag was actually sent to me by David's Bridal. I'm gonna be partnering up with them on some content leading up to my wedding which is now less than a year away which is crazy because back when I started planning it this in like January it just seemed so far away to me. Obviously as with most other brides-to-be I'm very familiar with David's Bridal. They are a go-to spot for all things wedding related. I think the best thing about this partnership and being a David's Bridal ambassador is that they left it completely up to me to decide what I wanted to cover, what I didn't want to cover. They didn't even force me to have to get my wedding dress through them. Like, it was literally like, hey, whatever you want to do wedding related, Sylvia, have at it. I wish I had that kind of support in every aspect of my life. <laughs> However, I do want to show you guys what's in this bag so you can get an idea of all the fun things to come. Look how cute this little bride canvas tote is. So the first thing is this little makeup bag. Is it glow in the dark? It kind of looks glow in the darky. I don't, I don't know, I'm gonna have to check. Inside they've included this mask which I probably need in my life. As well as this little keychain that says wife life. That's so cute. I'll start using this once I'm a wife. <laughs> they also included some fun accessories here. So here's some hair accessories from David's Bridal. Really cute pins. Ooh, this little rhinestone one's cute. Some metallic scrunchies. Oh, and these beautiful clips. Oh my God, these clips are so pretty. How cute. How cute. This is really cute stuff for me, but I think just also really cute stuff for like bridesmaids gifts as well as I'm just kind of looking at this and thinking about it. We also have here a silicone wine glass that says sip me baby one more time. <laughs> I'm a Britney Spears fan, so I can uh, appreciate that. Again, another really cute like bridesmaids gift. They also gave me this lace robe. Looks very, very bridal. Gorgeous lace robe right here. There are some socks that say the 
bride and of course a wedding planner i mean i feel like that's a must have oh it's fuzzy it's a fuzzy wedding planner oh this is cute there's like an about us page the bride's name screaming how we met the proposal checklists budget and guest list oh wow a lot of stuff so that's just a really 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 small glimpse of what they have to offer i'm excited to show you guys all the wedding stuff coming up let me know if you guys have any requests for types of wedding videos i was actually thinking of doing a wedding planning q a because um, i've had a lot of questions come up but yeah more to come so in continuation of the cleaning up that we're doing of my parents house with all my stuff Look at all the books I have to clean up. This is just like one bag out of probably like five bags of books that I have. I used to love reading as a kid. It was like my favorite thing to do. Um, and look, the Lizzie McGuire movie book. Yes. This is so nostalgic to me. I loved Archie comics. I loved collecting them. Every time I went to the store, I wanted to buy them. And I remember loving this series called The Amazing Days of Abby Hayes. Probably not like the most popular book but i really like her series do you guys remember the babysitters club this is like iconic in the 90s everyone read this book and the two of a kind mary kate and ashley books love their books love their movies and of course full house guys if you're in the 90s baby you have to remember these things right I was into the Pretty Little Liar series before it ever even became a show. I don't know if all of you guys know, but before it was a show, years before it was a show, it was actually books. And um, the show doesn't really follow the book line that closely, in my opinion. I mean, I stopped reading after a few, um, what are these called? Like series or like, but I do know that like from the series that I did read, a lot of the book doesn't follow it. So I was very disinterested in the television show. So while I've been in Ottawa, I've been reunited with my keyboard. Um, for you guys that, that don't know, I used to take piano lessons back in the day and I used to play the piano pretty like, I mean, I was still consider myself beginner to intermediate and I never really got super hardcore, but my parents invested a lot of years in teaching me how to play the piano. Um, and I kind of missed it. So I've been practicing a little bit and trying to actually reteach myself because I I'm not really great at reading music anymore and I'm just trying to reteach myself I feel like a beginner all over again. So I've been practicing a song and Ty's gonna come over and I want to show him what I've been practicing. <laughs> okay, nice and slow, right? right. Okay, well, yeah. ready? Go. Thai makes, the uh, Thai's mom makes these. Bon butler. I'm down. Down skis. Bon butler, miss. Down skis. You better be blessed that you get to eat the rest of that, huh? <laughs> Yo, continuation of the good foods. Winnie served me durian. <laughs> wow. Why, wow, you're really like cutting away at that, huh? All their brothers are gonna be so vexed after this. <laughs> Wakes up in the morning. <laughs> they're all vomiting at like three o'clock in the morning. Women Love women to see it. Like <laughs> it smells good. It smells sweet. Yeah, it smells like I don't know. It just smells like yeah, like sweet fruit. Maybe I should you know throw away all my my coworker. I asked her like, when, when do you think we're gonna go back? She's like, honestly, I don't think we're gonna go back. I don't know. I like have one. So I'm thinking. Well, like, I, I need you more. Harlow, you good? So, you good? She told me. And I, Thumbs up. Right now, she, they all think that I'm working. So Ty and I are here to watch Hudson play soccer. His very first time soccer leaguing. Why do you look so mad? Not. Ah, it's sunny. <laughs> Hudson number twelve. <laughs> Let's go! 
so I have used my mint plant many times already. I've been um, constantly harvesting it, but I just want to show you guys. Look at the girth of this one. This one's tick. It's tickums compared to all the other roots. So I'm hoping that good things come out of this one. So Ty and I are heading to a friend's wedding. Um, it's kind of raining outside right now, but it's going to be a beautiful wedding regardless. You look good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. You look good too. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I haven't worn earrings in such a long time. I don't usually wear like fancy earrings, so I like seeing myself with earrings on. That's it. I'm going to cry. Ty and I are doing our engagement shoots today, which is like uh, almost one year since our engagement. So we never got to do our engagement shots. So now this is it. Today is the day. Today is the day. Emily shooting for us. <laughs> Here's Emily, our photographer. Huh? This is how it's supposed to be with engagement. You wear like. Here. <laughs> Look at the face. <laughs> Your plate? All right. Can you guys, uh, you guys know what a plate is? Yeah. Please? So remember that um, skin consultation I did, I got the products that were recommended to me. I'm really excited to try these because I've tried a lot of Dermalogic Sugar products in the past, but I've actually never tried these three, um, so it'll be great to try some new stuff from my skin. Here is the Ultra Calming Cleanser, Soothing Cleanser. I told them that I don't really wash my face in the morning because they find that oftentimes it's very drying, and then it leads to me just having very dry skin. So I just use the toner to wipe it down. She suggested that I try using this calming cleanser, so it's very gentle and shouldn't be drying and then there's also this photo nature firming serum i've never tried anything from this line i don't think i was telling her about how i find that my um, skin isn't as uh, elasticized or firm anymore um, especially around my chin area and jaw area so she said that i should try this out and last but not least i deal with really dark circles now i don't know where my dark circles came from all of a sudden, I just got really dark circles. Um, so she told me to try this uh, Biolume C eye serum, which has vitamin C in it. So I don't have, I think I only have like one eye serum with vitamin C in it. So it'll be nice to give this one a try. Actually, the vitamin C eye product that I have is like eye cream. So the eye serum is uh, more concentrated.